In Dead by Daylight, people love map offerings, mostly to get an advantage and make the game easier for themselves. In this match, we got a Swift sending me to the game. This map is known to have a large amount of strong pallets, which can make it difficult to play as killer. Let's see how that worked out for our survivor team. Move back to the gen up here. Oh, nice. That is uh, no balance standing, actually. That's cool, that's cool, that's cool. I like that. Bro is taking the free injury. I respect it. One, two, three, four. Oh, she didn't even use an insta heal. She just baited it. She actually just baited it. City enough. They requested this map. And now I spawned the back end room that is basically a dead zone. I actually think that's karma. Like look, we have this gen here, this gen, this gen, and this gen. We can literally just circle in between. Oh. Here's not the records, that's unlucky. That's very unlucky. Do I have a hook here? I actually don't. Do I have a hook out there? I have one here, okay. That's cool. Well, they're actually kind of freaked here. What's with them teabagging and then doing a stupid play? It's like a common courtesy here. He got shit on, dude. Nah, 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 nah. He got literally violated in public. Bro just knew it was Joba for him. Bro just knew it was Joba. Oh, that was a little bit too high.
They really effed themselves with this map here though. They really effed themselves a little bit. See Fungmin going upstairs here. Are oh, they gonna be healing over there? Which lane? Oh, that was so close. She can't drop this either. And M1. Nice. I think we do the same setup here. Go here. Go here. And go here. Jeez, Nawa. Uh, one crow here. One crow window. Instincts above me. Up there. Right above me. Right there. Oh, he's no, actually, he's down here. Oh. He's 